Well, I know why I always refer clients to you, but when does like, when do you think, when do people really need you, you think, or when should people get a hold of you? Yeah, I mean, it's really interesting. It's like when you go to a contractor to build your house, right? Um, and you really want to talk to someone when you want to start the foundations or even the blueprints, right? Um, it's much more difficult to help someone who's hot partway through the build of their house and they say, hey, I've, I've started building my house and I've got, you know, the walls are not aligned and the plans don't match and I've got problem with the permitting. Um, and then, you know, the contractor's going to say, well, look, you know, I could probably still help you, but we've got a lot more work to do now as we sort of wind back and get back to the basics. So I would say uh, the sooner you can get to talk to an attorney, right, within the business space, the sooner you can get to even just an initial consult, the better, before you start out on that venture. Um, you know, I always offer my clients a free consult. I think it's important for a client to feel comfortable that they're not time bound, right. to really explain to them, or, or explain to you, sorry, what their situation is. Um, because that way they're gonna be on, set up for a much better path for success, right? Um, you can really tease out all of the problems with them. Uh, so I would say come to us, and I, I prefer it when clients come to me um, earlier in the life cycle of their transaction, you know, when they're starting a business, because it's, it's such a big venture. It's, this, this is potentially like their life dream is to start their business, or they've already got a growing business and, and, and kind of, you know, maybe on the tail end of it, and they're looking to sell a business. Well, even that is its own planning, right? And so I would urge someone when you're starting to think about it, it's worthwhile getting the advice then. And I think that's true for, for most areas of law. I like to say the earlier you plan for it, the better you're going to be set up for success. That's all, not always practical for, for some people, but I, I often think that it's limited because, you know, unfortunately clients and general public often will have in their mind that God, if I speak to an attorney, it's going to immediately cost money. It's very expensive as an endeavor. And, and, you know, I think that whole penny wise pound foolish thing rings very true in that context where they sort of want to save on the front end, but then they pay for it down the line. And again, that's why I say to clients that I'm always happy to do a consult for free. You know, I know I, actually, I just want to uh, throw one thing in there. One of the reasons that I get a lot of agent on our clients is because they haven't done their due diligence or don't have the handbooks in place or are not aware of overtime laws. And time and time again, ends up being, it ends up costing them thousands of dollars for th something that probably should have, or even tens of thousands of dollars and it should have co cost a lot less. Um, right, right, exactly. 